this is day seven. Um, I they started me on um, prednisone, ten milligrams, four times a day. Um, yesterday I took two. Um, my blisters were getting so bad that uh, they started to pop, and they were burning really, really bad. I had to actually um, stay in bed and keep my feet up, or else uh, they would start hurting and pulsating almost immediately. And that's where the band-aid is, the one that got broke open. But it's almost all, it turned into almost all blisters on this leg. Um, and it seemed like wherever I did scratch, again, I don't know if I said that in the former one, former video, that it, uh, that my skin just immediately reacted to it. Again, it's all up my leg. And here's my other leg, which doesn't seem to be too bad. I, I did wake up accidentally scratching at it, so... I didn't rip anything open though. And it's not as hot, it's not as painful, it's just uncomfortable and itchy. Um, I haven't heard from the doctor yet to see uh, about <clears throat> getting a specialist. It's a hematologist and um, specializing in, uh, I think it's blood. So. I'm sure they'll be doing some sort of biopsy, so. Anyway, it, it feels better just with taking two of the prednisones. I'm also taking <coughs> Advil, um, two over-the-counter Advils, and a Benadryl about every uh, four to six hours. And just mindful that I don't take too many but yesterday it was it got really really bad, and I'm really glad I the medication was <coughs> prednisone was um, filled, and I was able to start taking that. Um, normally these patches when they get really when my legs get really inflamed from standing, they um, flare up not that high but like you know pretty high to where you could fill it. But I mean the majority of the pain is from my knees to my ankles. So my whole feet were swelling right here, my ankles were swelling right here, and my calves were swelling, and my knees were swelling. Um, besides that, I wasn't having other, any other pain except extreme discomfort, um, the heat, and um, the itchiness. So hopefully you never have to deal with this, but if you do, at least, you know, you know somebody else who has too.